Hello and welcome to our channel. Welcome to our video on 25 crazy facts about North Korea. This secretive and isolated country is known for its unique and often bizarre policies, practices and traditions. From strict government control over its citizens to a cult of personality surrounding its leaders, there is much to learn about this enigmatic nation. So let's dive in and explore some of the most interesting and surprising facts about North Korea. Number 1. North Korea is the only country in the world where the government official prohibits religion. This means that religious practices are not allowed and any form of religious expression is strongly discouraged. It also means that the government has complete control over the belief system of its citizens. Number 2. The country has a 10 great public works project list that includes the construction of giant statues of its leaders. These statues are often massive in size and are meant to instill a sense of awe and reverence for the country's leaders. It also means that the government is trying to create a cult of personality around its leaders. Number 3. The government requires citizens to get permissions to travel within the country. This means that citizens must get clearance from the government before they can travel to different parts of the country, making it difficult for them to move around freely. This also means that the government has complete control over the movement of its citizens. Number 4. North Korea has a population of around 25 million people, but the government only recognizes about 200 surnames. This means that if your surname is not on the list, you may face discrimination and limitations on your opportunities in life. It also means that the government has a strict control over the social class system of its citizens. Number 5. The country has a three generations of punishment policy, which punishes not only criminals, but also their children and grandchildren. This means that if one member of a family is convicted of a crime, their entire family may be punished as well. This also means that the government uses fear as a way to maintain control over its citizens. Number 6. North Korea has a state-run system of Songbun, which determines a person's social class and limits their opportunities in life. The higher your Songbun, the more opportunities you have in life, and the lower it is, the more limited your opportunities become. It also means that the government has complete control over the social mobility of its citizens. Number 7. The government operates a network of labor camps, where prisoners are subjected to forced labor and harsh conditions. These labor camps are notorious for their brutal conditions and prisoners are often subjected to inhumane treatment. It also means that the government uses forced labor as a way to control citizens. Number 8. The country has a national holiday called the Day of the Shining Star, which celebrates the birthday of a former leader, Kim Jong-il. On this day, citizens are expected to show their loyalty and devotion to the country's leaders. It also means that the government uses national holidays to instill loyalty and devotion in its citizens. Number 9. North Korea has a supreme leader system in which the country's leader holds ultimate authority and is considered to be godlike figure. This means that the leader's words is considered to be law, and citizens are expected to show them absolute loyalty. It also means that the government uses a cult of personality to control its citizens. Number 10. The country's constitution guarantees free and universal health care, but in reality, the system is inadequate and underfunded. This means that many citizens do not have access to the healthcare they need and those who do often receive substandard care. It also means that the government is not fulfilling its constitutional obligations towards its citizens. Number 11. The government operates a strict censorship system in which all forms of media and information are heavily controlled and regulated by the state. This means that the citizens are very limited, have very limited access to information from the outside world and are often only exposed to state-approved media. It also means that the government uses this censorship as a tool for control and manipulation over its citizens. Number 12. 
the country has a Juche ideology, which emphasizes self-reliance and independence. This means that the government emphasizes its importance of being self-sufficient and not relying on outside help. It also means that the government uses this ideology as a way to justify its isolationist policies. Number 13. The government operates a strict dress code in which citizens are required to wear specific clothing and hairstyles. This means that citizens are not allowed to express themselves through their fashion choices and are required to conform the government standards. It also means that the government uses this strict stress code as a way to control its citizens. Number 14. North Korea has a closed city system in which certain cities are off limits to outsiders and only accessible to those with special clearance. These cities are often used for military and scientific research and are strictly controlled by the government. That also means that the government uses this restricted access to certain cities as a way to maintain control and secrecy. Number 15. The country operates a public execution system, in which criminals are publicly executed in order to defer others from committing the crimes. This means that citizens are exposed to brutal forms of punishment and are expected to be deterred from committing crimes by fear. It also means that the government uses fear as a way of control its citizens. Number 16. North Korea has a song and dance tradition in which citizens are required to practice in regular performances and shows. This means that the citizens are not allowed to express themselves freely through their artistic choices and are required to conform to the government standards. And it also means that the government uses the song and dance tradition as a way to control its citizens. Number 17. The government operates a strict system of guilt by association in which citizens can be punished for the crimes of their family members or friends. This means that citizens must be careful about who they associate with or risk being punished for the actions of others. It also means that the government uses guilt by association as a way to control its citizens. Number 18. North Korea has a military first policy in which the country prioritizes military spending and development over other areas. This means that the government allocates a large portion of its resources to the military, leaving less for the areas such as healthcare, education and infrastructure. It also means that the government uses military first policy as a way to justify its aggressive and expansionist policies. Number 19. The country operates a total surveillance system in which citizens are constantly monitored and watched by the state. This means that citizens have very little privacy and are always at risk of being caught for any perceived wrongdoing. It also means that the government uses surveillance as a tool for control and manipulation of its citizens. Number 20. North Korea has a personality cult surrounding its leaders, in which the leaders are idolized and worshipped as godlike figures. This means that the citizens are expected to show absolute loyalty and devotion to the leaders, and are not allowed to criticize or question their actions. It also means that the government uses personality cult as a way to control its citizens. Number 21. The country operates a strict class system, in which citizens are divided into different social classes and treated differently based on their class. This means that the citizens are not equal in the eyes of government and their opportunities in life are limited by their class. It also means that the government uses this class system as a way to maintain control and divide its citizens. Number 22. North Korea has a propaganda machine in which state-controlled media is used to spread the government's ideology and message. This means that the citizens are only exposed to state-approved information and are not allowed to access other sources of information. It also means that the government uses propaganda as a tool for control and manipulation of its citizens. Now, number 23. The country operates a strict border control system in which citizens are not allowed to leave the country without permission and outsiders are heavily restricted from entering. 
This means that citizens are effectively trapped in North Korea and are not allowed to travel or experience the outside world. It also means that the government uses border control as a way to control its citizens and maintain its isolationist policies. Number 24. Unique Cultural Heritage North Korea is a country that prides itself in preserving its traditional cultural heritage and preserving its rich history. The country is known for its unique architecture which is characterized by its beautiful and ornate places and monuments. In addition to its architecture, North Korea is also famous for its music, dance and food, which is all have a distinct and traditional flavor. The country's traditional music and dance have been passed down for generations and are an important part of its cultural identity. Number 25. Its scenic beauty. North Korea is a country with breathtaking landscapes and scenic beauty. One of the most notable natural attractions is Mount Paktu, the highest mountain in the country and the symbol of Korean nationalism. The mountain is located on the border between North Korea and China and is considered sacred by the Korean people. In addition to Mount Paktu, North Korea is also home to the serene Baekdu Daegan mountain range, which stretches across the Korean peninsula and is known for its beautiful forests and waterfalls. The country's national beauty and unique cultural heritage make it a fascinating and inspiring place to visit. As you can see, North Korea is a country with many unique and often bizarre facts and policies. From strict censorship to police, public executions to government uses various methods to maintain control over its citizens. It's important to remember that these facts are not just interesting stories, but they have real life implications on the lives of the North Korean people. If you've enjoyed this video, please give it a like and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more interesting and informative content. Thank you for watching.